about glazing. And then you can wipe off some of the glaze if you need. So if your problem is you don't know how to get dark enough, then you don't have to take a painting out and repaint it. Just think about trying to glaze it a little bit first. And then you can rub some of that off. So I do what's called area glazing a lot, which is not the whole thing, but just certain spots. If I wanted these blue bonnets to be uh, bluer, uh, I would take ultramarine blue and my liquid and just on my brush, say I want them bluer over here, I might take that blue and just sweep it across with a glaze and then wipe some of it off. And that's area glazing. It might have been that the painting needed violet and I might take some purple and do the same thing. Oop, almost put it in thinner. But a glaze is over a dry painting and it should be almost transparent. Say I wanted this to pick up more violet tone, then just glaze over them and turn them more violet. And then usually I wipe some of that off. And usually you can't even, you don't even know after you've done it, um, you don't, you know, it's just something that sometimes you have to do. Sometimes over shadow rocks to make them more seated in the painting. One thing you can do if you're totally wrong on what you've done, you can take a little paint thinner and take it all off. But it's really thin and it, and it, it helps a lot of people more than getting out of painting and trying to start from scratch. I'd like y'all to work on a patch of blue bonnets. <laughs>